I am not enough. I don't do enough. I don't have enough. I am not worth while. For years I have struggled with these beliefs until I realized something. I am a unicorn. A unicorn is someone who learns to embrace their shame in order to shine in their most authentic light. When I was 12, I remember hiding from my bullies in a boy's bathroom stall. He's so gay. He's so weird. Let's beat him up, faggot. I stood there, scared, just wishing I would disappear. For years after, I would hide myself in my studies and my books so that I could escape those feelings that took root in me when I was 12. I'm not enough. I don't do enough. I don't have enough. I am not worth while. Amidst my struggle to hide, I did promise myself that when I loved another man, I would come out. And I did. I was 24. I strategically came out to my parents right before they had to go to work. While they were getting in the car, I wouldn't let my mom close the passenger side door and I said, I have something to tell you, I am gay. My mom said, no, you're not. And my dad said, we'll deal with that later. The next day, an argument was had that ended in these words I will never forget. I want the son I raised back. The feelings that took root in me at 12 were in full bloom at 24. That I am not enough, that I don't do enough, that I don't have enough, that I am not worth while. Shame hides in all of us, but when we embrace our shame, we begin to shine. One day, my therapist said to me, Justin, I have these four sentences for you that you must apply to yourself every day. They will be your medicine. Let's practice in front of a mirror. I stood there in front of the mirror, face to face, eye to eye with myself for the first time and said, I am enough. I do enough. I have enough. I am worth while. The tears began to well up in my eyes and my body began to shake. My right hand was so tight in a fist, so tightly wanting to hold on and so desperately wanting to let go. The power of the tears was so strong that I was knocked to my feet and then I heard the embrace of my therapist's words. Just him. You were a resilient young boy who learned to withstand and withhold so many emotions. You no longer have to do that. All you have to do is feel. Feeling my shame is the healing. Each morning, with gentle discipline, I embrace my shame and apply my medicine to myself with compassion. I am enough. I do enough. I have enough. I am worthwhile. Each sentence embraces the 12 year old me and shines light to never hide yourself, even when you want to disappear. Each sentence embraces the 24 year old me and shines light to love yourself unconditionally because that is the key to giving and receiving love. When my parents said, I want the son I raised back, I realized they saw a son living in shame, not the son they raised in love unconditional. A son still seeking love, validation, and acceptance outside of himself. A son seeking an embrace, yet unable to give and receive one from himself. I have spent so many years hiding my story even finding refuge as an artist and performer, as a vessel to tell others stories. Today, I am here as the vessel to finally tell my story, to shine light to the unicorn that I am, that in the face of it all, even when shame arises, as it will, with gentle discipline, I will embrace my shame and apply my medicine to myself compassionately. This time, not just in front of a mirror, but in front of you all, to declare and shine in, I am enough. I do enough, I have enough, and I am worth.
wild. I stand, a unicorn rising from shame to shine.